goodness, it's been a hot minute, hasn't it? <laughs> it is hot. <laughs> it's been a hot minute since I filmed a YouTube video. I was looking back at my YouTube videos last night and I was like, oh my goodness, like I need to film. I need an update. So much has changed in my life. So much has happened. Um, I'll get into a lot more of that later, but happy Tuesday. It's my first day off work in a really long time. I've been balancing like two jobs at once, like kind of three jobs at the same time, as well as doing her help stuff and just like trying to live a good life and things like that as well. So it's been crazy, but I'm like, oh my goodness, I need to update my YouTube fam on my life, which is so exciting. This morning, I've just been out to my horse and given my horse a feed. Um, and then I went for a little run. I went for a half an hour run, hence the very sweaty face. Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something bad features. But now I thought I would drive to the beach and have a quick swim. And I'm doing some fun things this afternoon as well. Then I thought I'd take you guys along and just see what a new day in my life is like because a lot has changed. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited to take you along with the day. I'm so excited to go for a swim. I'm so hot. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see. My favorite part about working weekends is that when you do have a day off, it's usually a weekday, which is really exciting because that means I have the whole freaking beach to myself, which is just amazing. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. Must be something that features. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. You see her walking down the boulevard. It's cold, <laughs> but nice, nice and cold. <laughs> cold. No fly in those Gucci slides. Yeah, yeah, out. Oh, so finished at the beach. Oh my goodness, that was so nice. I'm so hot. <laughs> It's not even like, it's cloudy outside, so you can't even feel how hot it is or see how hot it is, but it was so nice. Um, and now I'm off to quickly freshen up at mum's, do like a bit of a like, oh, I'm hot, put a, some clothes on, put my dress back on, and then going to go get my car serviced. But the beach was so nice, so to have the whole strip, the whole strip of beach to myself was absolutely incredible. Oh, I'm hot, I need some water. <laughs> That literally took five minutes, which was amazing. But when they get their car service, I hate people moving my seat in my car because I can never get it back to like how I wanted it. <laughs> I feel like this has literally just turned into a car vlog. Like, where am I going in my car today? <laughs> um, but I've just been over to mum's. I picked up a school shirt for my brother. Picked up a night moisturizer for me it's my body shot one and then my little journal which is really cool i'm loving it so much my best friend macy bought it for me for my birthday um and it's just like um all these little questions and it's like weekly reviews and stuff and i've been doing it like consistently every sunday night i'll sit down and reflect on my week and i'm loving it so i'm just i'd bring this back home with me as well to dad's so that I can write in it on Sunday because I don't want to miss one because I'm finding it really cool to like write down how I have been going and just watching my personal it's totally one thing to just like see photos and videos and stuff of your life and how it was and I have the app one second every day I don't know if anyone else has it or heard of it but it's really cool and it's like I've been doing that for three years and it's where in that moment so to have a weekly reflection where you can sit down and think about your thoughts and feelings um, is really cool and I've really been enjoying it um, and it just shows how much personal growth I've actually been doing which is very very cool but I'm off home now to do some work for her help so let's go <laughs> on the road again when you smile at the ground it ain't hard to tell you don't know oh, oh, you don't know you do I hopped on the train at LAX with a dream my card again now I've just been sat on the end of my bed doing some her help stuff which is so exciting um, I'm in the process of writing a book which is really cool and I'm loving it it's about self-help self-growth um, and learning to love yourself um, 
I obviously am not in a relationship anymore and I feel like I made that very public on my channel and across my Instagram stuff and I know a lot of you guys are following that. Um, we broke up in November um, and one day I might talk about it but not anywhere near to yet but it's been the best thing that's ever happened to me it honestly has and I've learned so much about myself and my life and um, who I am as a person and I feel like I've as I've been learning I've been putting a lot of it into a book to help others but I found myself in a really lucky situation um, and I'm really happy so that's all that matters <laughs> um, but there's also been some really cool things that have happened in the last two months I've gotten um, a new job which is so cool I met this beautiful, beautiful person named Caitlin. She's amazing. She used to be like an international model and now she, like she used to model for like Chanel and Prada and like she's amazing. Um, and she's an app developer and she's really cool. Sorry, my phone's giving me the absolute willies. That bit cut out. <laughs> um, I was saying that like Caitlin is so cool. She reached out to me via LinkedIn because she's an app developer and um, we went and got coffee together and turns out that she really liked my designs for the new app of what I'm working on. And she said, these are really good. Like, do you actually want a job designing apps? Because I can see that. And um, like the next day, or that was a Friday. And then the following Monday, I was in her office working for her designing apps, which was so cool. And then her sister who lives in Sydney flew over and Caitlin's like, you have to meet Lexi. And I got to meet her sister, Jordan. And she has her own social media marketing company, which is what I'm studying to do at uni. And she said that she wanted to offer me a job as well. And Jordan has like clients like Spotify and I'm pretty sure she's done some work for McDonald's and stuff. Like she's incredible. And she offered me a social media marketing. So I've got two jobs now doing that so both app designing and social media marketing for the two sisters which oh my god i'm so sorry the one day i try and film like a vlog my phone's shitting itself i'm so excited for september when the new iphone comes out because this phone is horrible um it's been choppy like choppy changing because i'm having to film on snapchat because um my audio on my normal camera the video like there's a buzzing noise with it the storage is always up like i'm just so ready for a new phone <laughs> fresh start but i am going really well i'm so unbelievably happy i've got so many amazing opportunities and life's really good like i am actually happy and i think the biggest thing is sometimes you don't know how toxic a situation is in your life or how unhappy you are until you step out of it and you're in a situation where you genuinely are really happy and there's opportunities and people around you that like you do really love and appreciate um so this year has been a uh, last year was definitely a learning curve and this I was going to sit down now and do some more her help work on my laptop, but I think I have to go through my storage on my phone and figure out anything and everything that I can delete off my phone because um, I want to continue this vlog because I've got some exciting things happening this afternoon. I've got um, a meeting with a woman's organization. There's like a board meeting every Tuesday, the first Tuesday of every month or the second Tuesday. I don't know. A Tuesday every month. <laughs> um, and I went last time like last month and it was really beautiful and nice um it's about like women empowering women and like homeless shelters and just some really cool stuff so tonight my boss is coming along caitlin um and she's actually speaking so i'm so excited to go watch that i'm gonna pick her up tonight i'm gonna have some dinner and listen to some cool people i just think it's so inspiring and makes me want to do her help stuff even more so I'm gonna go do that. I'm gonna sort my phone out and I'll check in with you a bit later on. <laughs> Ignore the weird camera angles. I tried to figure out how I could show you my pants with like the landscape view on my camera and I can't. So I'm just gonna have to, we'll go with this, okay? <laughs> cool. <sighs> this is my outfit for the, um, so that's right. This is my outfit for um, the board meeting tonight. I have one issue, these pants, are really wrinkly and usually I'm like a rocker you know wrinkle pant like it's fine but I'm going to an event and there's lots of like older ladies who like this is like their one outing of the week and they all dress super nice with makeup and like really lovely like high heel shoes and stuff I'm gonna rock him with my wrinkly pants on and be like hi <laughs> And they'll be like, look where our hands are. Like, look at the future generation. This is like what is being left. They're like, do I really care? No. Um, now I'm just straightening my hair 
because it's so fluffy and like beachy and hot and it's so hot it's still like a really hot day today and the last thing I like doing is like putting hot on my hair because you just feel all like super super hot but there's definitely a difference between like crazy okay it's still crazy I've still got a little bit of work to do okay we'll come back <laughs> Right, off we go. I'm so excited to pick up Cameron and have our cute little boardroom dinner. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film in the boardroom meeting. Hi! You smell amazing! Hi! Hi! Oh, so I've just finished our little meeting. Um, Caitlin and I went and had a wine after the meeting, which was so lovely. It was so nice to just have some D and M's with her. Like, she is honestly so unbelievably amazing. And I'm just like counting all my lucky stars to have been able to connect with her. She's just incredible. And I'm so excited. And I feel like all the shitty stuff that's happened in the past year has like led me to where I need to be right now and it's just the coolest thing she's so inspiring she's so amazing and we just had a massive like DM, like a massive deep and meaningful about everything so I'm so excited to be working with her Duncan and I are home now eating minties <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the day. I hope you enjoyed coming along with me on my little Tuesday. I love you guys so much. I definitely want to be filming more YouTube videos, that's for sure. But I love you guys so, so much and I hope you had the most amazing day. I'd love to hear about